I'm Amy from Doodle Dog Designs. I would like to have an antique shoe fly, but they're kind of difficult to find. And so I came across this antique wire strainer. It's pretty bad shape, kind of rusty, and uh, I love this handle. I'm going to use it as part of the shoe fly too. So in order to make this into a shoe fly, the first thing I'm going to need to do is cut off these pieces here and here and then the handle. I'm going to use a Dremel tool to do this. I'm going to use a cutting wheel on the Dremel tool. When you use the Dremel tool, you want to be sure you're wearing safety glasses and using other safety precautions. After cutting off the handle, I realized that the heat generated was burning a hole in my tablecloth. So I used pieces of wood underneath for the other two parts that needed to be cut off. So be careful when you're using the Dremel. It does create a lot of heat and it sparks and pieces of metal can fly off. You might have to do a little sanding with the Dremel to get them smooth and not pokey. I'm going to take the handle and cut it off right here in this grooved part to make a knob for the shoe fly. So I cut off the handle and there's this little area right here on the strainer that we drilled a hole in the knob so the hole will fit right over that little notch. And I'm going to add a little bit of glue, just using some craft glue. I'm gonna put a little bit of glue right here in the hole. Then I'm going to stick it over that notch and just let it dry. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Be sure to click the like button and subscribe below. I'll see you next time. Bye.